Hey everyone, welcome back to Factic, I'm Barry Alex, and today, I'm thrilled to share my thoughts on the DJI Osmo Pocket 3, a compact camera that's been making serious waves in the creator community. Whether you're a seasoned videographer, a vlogger, or just someone who loves capturing life's special moments, this tiny powerhouse promises to deliver exceptional quality without the hassle of bulky equipment. In this review, we'll explore its standout features, from the impressive 1-inch sensor to its superior stabilization and audio quality. I'll also share my personal experiences using it at a WWE SmackDown show and compare its performance to other devices. If you want more information about this camera, check out the links in the description below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you never miss an update. Let's get started. First off, the Osmo Pocket 3 is pocket-sized, but don't let that fool you. It packs a punch with its larger 1-inch CMOS sensor. This means better low-light performance and more reliable autofocusing, putting it way ahead of most smartphone cameras. The video quality is so good that it almost rivals my full-frame Sony mirrorless, especially in low-light situations. My first big test with the Pocket 3 was at a WWE SmackDown show. Now, you can't bring a big camera to these events, but the Osmo Pocket 3 got in without a hitch. I wanted to capture some stabilized audience footage, and let me tell you, the results were impressive. The footage was so good, it could easily make it into WWE's social media reels. Using the Osmo Pocket 3 is super easy. Just swivel open the display, hit the record button, and you're good to go. No need to mess around with complicated settings or heavy equipment. It's perfect for those moments when you want to live in the moment but still capture high-quality footage. Now, let's talk about performance. The Pocket 3 can only do a 2x digital zoom, so it's not going to give you those dreamy, bokeh-heavy shots that you'd get with a more advanced camera. But for everyday shooting, it's fantastic. The audio quality is also top-notch, with multiple microphones that capture clear sound even in noisy environments. The battery life is another highlight. With a 1,300 mAh battery, you can get 2 to 2.5 hours of filming on a single charge. Plus, it charges super fast, up to 80% in just 16 minutes. If you need even more battery life, there's an optional battery handle that extends the runtime by about 60%. One of the coolest features is the support for higher frame rates and professional picture profiles. You can shoot in 4K at 120 frames per second for some amazing slow motion footage. And with D-Log and HLG profiles, you get more dynamic range and flexibility in post-processing. Of course, it's not perfect. The Osmo Pocket 3 isn't exactly pocket-friendly despite its name, and it's not waterproof, so you'll need to be careful around water. For still photography, I probably still reach for my smartphone. But for video, it's hard to beat the convenience and quality this camera offers. Overall, the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 is a fantastic tool for creators who want high-quality video without the hassle of bulky equipment. It's fun and easy to use, making it a great addition to any creator's toolkit. Whether you're vlogging, shooting action scenes, or just capturing everyday moments, the Osmo Pocket 3 is definitely worth considering. And this is the review of DJI Osmo Pocket 3. If you're interested in this camera, check out the link in the description below for more information. And if you found this video useful, then like the video and also hit that subscribe button. And if you have any question or suggestion for our next review, feel free to comment below. Until then, goodbye and take care.